Lehigh Valley Fashion Week Season 7 was an experience. We went ahead and did a showcase that was a lot smaller than what we typically would do due to the pandemic. We wanted to go ahead and tread light, but we had a lot of photo shoots. We worked with new designers that on um, boutiques that we've never worked with before, and we really enjoyed it. Everybody came together, and some of the brands are, like I said, new brands and launching for the first time. We love to give all types of people opportunity, as those, and, and they also give us opportunity too. So these are some of the models that we had a great time with. They did such an outstanding job. Everybody pulled this together in about a month and a half's time. Uh, I tell everybody, you got to give yourself a pat on the back. Some of you have never done this before, and to bring this to the Valley in a dynamic way is awesome. Now, for our August show, it's going to be all the way live. I always try to make sure my kids come and see what their mommy is doing so they can learn. And I have great a great team. Uh, Carrie Holmes, she's my publicist. She does the PR work for me. Uh, it's, I, I'm a little difficult for her to really put her nails, sink her nails into a project and this is Talisha my business partner baseline Marisol Emily again we have new models this right here is Katie she's one of the new models that we've just met this season and she's wonderful and also Corey and his wonderful sister who's also a stylist they both are fierce there she is in the background again I'm between I make sure I make time for my kids Titus is like Loving the production world. I cannot wait to see uh, what we're going to do. we got Chevy and Xavier. I mean, our kids, they've been hanging in there because mommy's on the go. Marisol is one of my long-time friends. This is uh, Tiffany. She's another um, event planner. We have the pageant queens and little R&R. &R. And here's our Carrie, one, once again, said, you got to do a press conference. Story. Come on, let people see you. And our, our team, our supporters, our friends all came out. It was a weekday when the Hyatt Place uh, uh, let us go ahead and have our fashion week there. Like I said, we did it small. But the small things can pack a, pack a punch. We brought kids back this season. Some of our good models that we've worked with in the past. This is Antonella. She's a, a signature, one of our signature models from the past. And uh, we always enjoy working with the models that have been with us from day one. She does a lot of content creation, and I just love that she came out to see the new warehouse. Carrie, again, <laughs> working with me, Burning Midnight Oil, her and Talisha just were so, so, so involved. And I mean, they, uh, Talisha has kids, so she knows how it is. You know, we both make sure our kids are fully involved in what we're doing. I mean, the road to Lehigh Valley Fashion Week was not a breeze, as most businesses, and, and when you're starting up there, it's a lot of sweat. As they say blood and tears that goes into it but we're doing this for our children we're doing this for our families so, you know we all both of us are married and we have the lovely just sent uh Hedlum. she is so wonderful with her inner star which she has a big event coming up in um august and it's going to be the launch the premiere of inner star and oh my goodness everyone was just so wonderful rosie and um Oh my gosh, Tilted Halo. We got, I mean, it, it's just wonderful. And then my, my, my baby boy, Chevy. He's going through his terrible twos, as they say. And we got Brianna, Beat by Bella, Rosie, and Blondie. It's hard. Some days it's really hard. <laughs> I just gave birth to this lovely, lovely, handsome gentleman, Xavier. And, um... Uh, Still pull through to be able to do a fashion week months after giving birth. My husband holds it down when he can. He also has a very busy schedule. And we're just doing what we can to raise these kids and have these brands. And, and can't forget my rider and my dad. Oh, gosh. How many times have we burned the midnight oil getting this warehouse together? Making sure it's up to par. Oh, scraping and painting and the things you don't see. But it all comes out in the end to be dynamic we still have a long way to go but we're here and we are doing it baby and shout out to my brother adam who's always holding it down and my bestie charity and kenyatta she wins totally <laughs>